All right, math doesn't suck. So you just need a good teacher. So here you have a total of uh, what dollar ninety five in quarters and dimes, and uh, you had a good equation coming in. That's ten times number of dimes plus twenty five cents of quarter, and altogether you have a one hundred ninety five cents. This is all very good. And the only thing that's missing is basically you used up the first equation. The basically that's missing is the second equation. It said there are four times as many dimes. So dimes, let's draw it. Okay, dimes has more. All right, and then quarters are bigger. So quarters are here. So let me move this up a little bit. So the second equation, you gotta. There's an equation with a quarter and a dime. You gotta decide which side is more. Um, reading from this is really easy just to say, well, there's a four times dime equal to quarter. Okay, this is actually the wrong one. Now think about it, what we're we actually saying. There are more dimes than quarter. So quarter times four is equal to dime. Think about it. If I have a one quarter, then I have four dimes. If I have two quarters, so then I have eight dimes. Dime is the more. So you don't want the equation. Here again, it's, you, if I have a one quarter here, then you have four dimes. If I have two quarters here, and then you have eight here. So you want a dime to be the bigger one. Okay, what I tell my students is, you want to put the number that's bigger here, and then, then you put this factor of four, such that this one end up to be a bigger number. Okay, now you have two equations, two unknowns, that should be pretty easy to solve from here. Let's give it a try here. Uh, since we know dime is equal to four quarters, so easy thing to do, of course, is just a substitute. Okay, four um, dime is equal to here. I actually got this one wrong. So ten is four quarters is here, plus twenty five quarter is equal to one ninety five cents, which is a pretty good equation there. And then we have a 40 quarter plus 25 quarter is equal to 195. And then 65 quarter is equal to 195. Quarter is equal to 3. If you divide it, you'll see it. It's pretty easily. It's 3. Since dime is 4 times of the quarter, right? So I have 12 dimes. Here's the 12 dimes. Here's the quarter, right? That was not bad. Have a confident day.